Huh? What's that sound outside, Mikey? I think, or is it bloody rain? Huh? But why did it rain today? Get ready, Mikey. Think this day will be very difficult. Huh? During the red blood rain, all villagers or other mobs turn into monsters. They become stronger, angrier, and of course, more aggressive. Hmm. Why do we always get into all sorts of trouble? Yeah! You were right, JJ. Because of the red blood rain, the villagers became monsters. Hmm. Run away, I don't like them. Yeah. Did you see how many teeth they have? <laughs> how scary they are. Hope they do not catch up with us. We need to find someone who will help us. Like in the village with the golem. <gasps> oh no! Ouch! Uh-oh. You see that, Mikey? <laughs> He's a zombie too. I thought the golem wouldn't be a zombie. He's got very strong skin. What do we do next? It turns out that everyone in the village is infected except us. Why are we always in the center of all the trouble? <laughs> Let us go, or we'll tell the sheriff! Yeah. I forgot that all the villagers are zombies now. But what are we going to do, JJ? Hmm. What are they going to do with us? The only thing we can do is surrender to them. I hope they don't test us on zombies. I don't want to be like them. Oh. Let us go. I warn you, zombies are villagers. If you don't let us go now, we will take revenge on you. What do you want with us? Why are you silent? Say anything, or do you lack brains? I will tell you from the beginning, you have contacted the wrong people. You lose. What bold words. You will do nothing to us. We will turn you into just like us. You will become a zombie. Uh -oh. What are you going to do? You think your empty threats scare me? In case you haven't noticed, it's you tied up here. We specifically summoned this bloody rain to destroy you. Yeah. There are no more villagers oh no. left in the village, yeah. so you're the last people who can stop us. But now, no one can stop us. What are you laughing at, Snoopy? <laughs> you really think you're going to stop us with some chains? The first thing we're going to do when we get out of here is get back at you. Yep. Your plan will fail from the start because you attacked us. We will stop you and your red rain. What's your next plan? To look at us and laugh. You did good, JJ. You got him out. Now we need him. You got him so pissed off they're gone. <laughs> all right, what's next? Do you have a plan or do you want to stay here all night? Hmm. Look, JJ, maybe we can break the chains, but no, they're too strong. <laughs> you won't believe me, Mikey. <gasps> I found this in my pockets. Turns out I forgot to put the TNT in the trunk. <laughs> in other words, we have TNT. We can get out of here. Hmm. Although, I think it will be very dangerous. But doing nothing is much worse. I hope the TNT doesn't hit me, or I wouldn't want to die that way. <laughs> Great! I got it on the outside. Woohoo! Excuse me, Mikey. <laughs> if I break you out, they'll notice there's no one here. I'll save you, but later. I'll get help, so just wait. Hmm. hmm. How dare JJ leave me here, even though I understand why he did it. Wait, I think, or there's someone coming, so this Enderman. Hey, come here. I need your help. How you didn't turn into a monster in the first place in the bloody rain? And the Endermen are afraid of water. How can you walk in the rain? Listen, it's not important. Help me break these chains or something. Hey, Mikey. Why are you hanging there? Are you comfortable? I found an amulet that protects me from water and lava, so I'm not afraid of water now. <gasps> You're telling me to help you, but how am I gonna break this chain? I know I'm strong, but I'm not that strong. You have a plan, and listen to where JJ is. You're best friends with him. You usually go together. Fine! You put the blocks over me. I loosened the chains a little so I can get out. Woohoo! Now I'm free. How nice it is not to hang on chains, but to stand on your own feet. Can you give me an ender pearl? Yeah, sure, here you go. Why do you need it? Woohoo! I just have a theory I want to test. All right, Mikey, mind your own business, and I'm going to see how the amulet works. Tell me about your experiment. Yep, great, zombie out. Now we have to hit the ender pearl. Nice, he seems to have stopped. Now I have to get the ender pearl right in his head. Huh? Woohoo! I did a good job. Now I'm in the head of an infected zombie villager, and he's got nothing. And there's a funny echo. And there are two small cockroaches. Although, in fact, they are not so small. We should kill them. 
but I do not want to run after them so much. And I especially do not have a sneaker to kill cockroaches. Well, hmm. they still do not bother me. I want to try to control the zombies. Usually the smarter the man is, the harder it is to control. Woohoo! I can't even believe I made it. I really got into the village mind. Okay, you have to try to control it. How many buttons here, in case I press the wrong button? Although it's not important, you have to try. Huh? But I think I won't have a problem. So what is this green button? Like, I understood the controls here, like, in a video game! <laughs> Woohoo! Well done! Now I can control the body of this infected zombie villager. So what do I do now? I need to find JJ. And I'm sure he was very surprised to see me. Although now I am in this body, I can scare him. He left me. This way, I will get him back. <laughs> problem is, I have to find JJ, but I don't know where he is, so it doesn't matter if I think he's somewhere in the country. I don't think he got far. We should go see where we hung on the chains. Maybe he went back there. Woohoo! All right, here comes JJ. He's going to a place where we used to have fun. Hmm. So he came to rescue me, but it's too late. Well, he sees that I'm not there, and I wonder what he'll do next. This is a great moment to scare him. I think he's going to get really scared. <gasps> He's going somewhere. You have to follow him. I want to scare him so much that he'll remember for the rest of his life that betraying me was never worth it. I wonder where he's going. Building. I think I know he's going to his house. Hmm. Where did Mikey go? Maybe he managed to get out. Well, it doesn't matter. I really want to sleep. Tomorrow, I'll know what happened to Mikey. So he's going to bed now. It's a great idea to scare him. I hope the door won't have a lock on. The door is perfectly open. His bed was on the second floor. I'll go up to him and scare him. Great. And JJ, how he sleeps so comfortably. I'm gonna wake him up, and I'm gonna put on the best show of my life. So now we need to wake him up and scare him. And I think when he wakes up, he's gonna be really scared. And I think he's gonna win from here when he wakes up. Wake up, JJ. What? I brought you a <gasps> present. You love surprises, oh, so no. you'll be very happy. That you need an infected zombie, you came to avenge me for getting out of your trap. Yep. You think I'm gonna let you take me down. If you really think so, then you're wrong. Oh. I'm gonna break the window and run away. Try to catch up with me, zombies. I run really fast. <laughs> Wait, JJ, how slow this thing is. I can't run any faster. <laughs> That's the maximum speed this zombie villager can run. Wait, JJ, you can't run from me. You can run, but you can't hide from me. You think you can hide from me in a graveyard if you really think you're wrong. <sighs> hmm. Listen, policeman, I am so glad to see you. I was followed by an infected zombie villager. He came to my house, woke me up, and chased me. Help me, he's on the street. Let's arrest him. <gasps> and you see what's going on in the street? It's raining blood on the street. It's driving everyone crazy. There's your infected zombie villager. I see him. <laughs> JJ, don't worry. We're going to catch him. We know what's going on. We're already looking for an antidote or an antidote. <laughs> we just don't have enough hands right now. <laughs> but we've caught almost all the infected. <laughs> Guys, come on. We almost got this infected guy. We can't let him go. <gasps> so I'm stuck in a cemetery. I have to hide somewhere or I'll get caught by the cops. Why this prank got out of hand? Why it all went wrong? Great! I think I'll hide behind the Etude tree. Guys, look for him! He's gotta be around here! He definitely ran here! Quick look around! We need to find the Golem and the Monticore, and we haven't found them either! Hmm. Great! They don't see me. Hope they don't find me here. I need to think about what I'm gonna do next. I never got my revenge on Mickey. I need to think of something else. I need to think about what I'm gonna do next. I never got my revenge on JJ. I need to think about it. I have to get out of this cemetery, but there are so many cops. They said they haven't found the Golem and the Manticore yet. Maybe I should find them. <laughs> Hello, infected villager. How are you? We saw a crowd of policemen and came here, and the poets came here. We thought they were infected here too. Huh? Oh, hey, how are you? I'm definitely infected too. So listen to me, help me get revenge on JJ. I want to scare him very much. I already tried to do it myself, but I failed. So what will help me? I personally don't mind helping you. You can sit on me. I'm a manticore, so we can find the right person very quickly. Only I'm warning you, you're going to be shaking so hard. <laughs> so hold on tight. Look, the three of you said his name was JJ. Wasn't that the one we'd be happy to chain up in the afternoon? Hmm. Look, what do you want to do with him when you find him? 
Hmm. I don't know what I'm gonna do to him, but I think it's funny. He left me. That's why I want to get back to him. How cool it is. I've never flown before. It's just an incredible feeling. I'm like a bird. Okay, let's focus on JJ. I don't know exactly where he is, but I think he's somewhere in the village. He's average height, in red clothes. If you see him, tell me. JJ, I know you're here. Hmm. There's JJ. He's at the police station. I knew he was in the village. Manticore, let's shoot. We gotta catch up with JJ. Look, maybe we can somehow draw him out. I think it's better. Hmm. He looked at us, but he didn't seem to notice. Because of the night, you can't see anything, so he didn't see. Let's get a little closer, so he can see us and run outside. You said he didn't see us, and you're sure he did? Maybe JJ saw us, but he just didn't show. And even if he didn't see us, I think he's going to go out and go home soon. I think we're going to have to wait a little while, and he'll be out soon. Hmm. I think you're right about the Manticore. JJ is finally out of the police station. Let's go after him, but be careful he doesn't see you. I want to scare him, although I think I already did it. I think we can descend the Manticore. I warn you, this is my battle, and you must not interfere with the Manticore. I get it when we get down there and I let you go. I'm gonna do my thing. I just need to get to the police station. Come on, we're starting. I think JJ was really surprised when he found out the truth, and that would be fun. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna break down JJ's house, but you sure are funny. What superpowers I have, I can fly, but I don't have Ender Dragon fireballs. <laughs> I'll break his house with razor-sharp claws. They can even easily cut steel. I think your revenge is good. I think you're happy now. <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> Get out of my house! It's like a manticore from the very legends he makes at my house. Uh-oh! And the other question is, why is it breaking my house? <laughs> it's you again? Why are you following me? Wait, that voice of Mikey is what are you doing? Oh. Yeah, I'm Mikey. I'm going to destroy your house, JJ. You shouldn't have left me. Now I can get back at you. Huh? <laughs> I did great! Now I have to get out of here. How do I do that? Hmm. I thought JJ said it needed a special device, but I don't have it with me. So I will improvise. There are two cockroaches, and what should I do with them? Huh? Normally, JJ would come up with a brilliant rescue plan, so I need to figure out what I'm gonna do. I think I got it! There's a stake in my inventory, and I'm gonna feed these roaches, and they're gonna get strong, and they're gonna break the blocks, and then I can get out and go! <laughs> Woohoo! Excellent cockroaches ate the meat I gave them. Listen to cockroaches break two blocks here so I can get out. <laughs> Outside, such food will be full, so you can have a very good lunch. Great! Hmm. I wonder how Mikey's doing. It turns out all this time he was that infected zombie. It's a shame he broke my house. By the way, I noticed that the red-blooded rain has stopped. It is very good now. <laughs> In our village will not be infected villagers. What beautiful fresh air. Come on, we caught you. Now you can't escape from here. We will help you. We have a cure for you that will make you normal again. So just give up and everything will be fine. I see that Mikey managed to leave two criminals. You're good, Mikey. <laughs> if you've broken the house, you must rebuild it. And no objection, I see your partner dumped you, so you'll be working for two people. Now we know how to break people's houses. Hmm. Look, Mikey, I know it was you. I even know why you decided to attack me. All because I abandoned you. Yep. But I'm back in a few minutes, but it's still my fault. Look, Mikey, as an apology, I'll buy you ice cream in the morning when the ice cream shop opens. <laughs> Woohoo! Great! I'm just hungry and I really want ice cream. Okay, JJ, then I forgive you. <laughs> 